Hey, this is Rhonda and Brian. We're on the road with the Grand Rapids Real Estate Show. We like to take you guys to some interesting and unique properties, and we found one out here in Byron Center, Michigan. I'm going to take you on this piece of land. It's 19 acres of beautiful, wooded, secluded, rural um, value. And as I come up in here, I remember there's kind of an interesting story to the previous owner. What was it again, Brian? Well, the original owner spent over $3 million on this property and improvements in this area and uh, borrowed a good amount of that from the bank. And when asked why he built such a huge facility that is more like an office building or a church than a home, his answer was, because I can. Well, the economy and um, some time led to some difficulties and ultimately the bank took the property back about a year ago a local investor um, from this area has purchased it and repaired or replaced a lot of the things that were taken out of the property here's the seven acres in the middle of it right now to restore it basically to where somebody can take it from here and restore it for their use oh yeah i can totally see this place being changed um into something like maybe a winery, a brewery, um, office complex, maybe even a sports complex, maybe an educational facility. It's just um, construction-wise very sturdy. It's poured concrete walls. We have uh, steel roofing. It is absolutely beautiful back here. I have to take you inside and show you this unique building. Okay, well now that I've got you out here, you need to take a look at the size of this building. It's 20,000 square feet on two floors, and we contacted the original contractor who built it, and he said today it would cost $2.5 to rebuild it. Remember, we're sitting on 19 acres, and he's just talking about the facility itself. Um, we're going to throw out some ideas to you that we've thought of for the use of this property, but remember that it is zoned agricultural and you would have to contact the township to get approval on any of your ideas. Some of the things we've thought of is an educational facility, a training center, um, some commercial uses might be to put a winery here, a brewery, or a restaurant. With all the surrounding farm property, you could grow crops on it to use in a restaurant. Um, some other ideas are a sports complex or a church or just a business office complex. Um, we'd like to give you a tour of the inside, but we need to have you fill out a form that comes down on the screen with just your name and email. And we don't share that information with anyone else, but I'd like to take you inside. So if you could do that, come on in and follow me. You are now entering the main front door of this building. You're coming in on the main floor, and this is the foyer area. You have to take a look at the really unique design with the steel beams and the tin um, roof. Very tall ceilings. We're estimating they're 28 feet tall. You're coming into limitless possibilities. We have 10,000 square feet here, and it's lined with windows at the top of the building that let in natural light. We're sitting secluded out here in 19 acres. Beautiful view out all the windows of the woods. We're thinking as we tour this building of all the possibilities, such as a business setting, office space, community center, a sports complex, maybe even a brewery. It's got a great industrial contemporary feel inside and lots of possibility because we're full of electric all over the flooring, on the walls, we have cable here throughout the whole building. There are four bathrooms upstairs here, plumbed, and there's all little alcoves of storage. And I have to take you off into the next area where we will show you um, some of the private areas of the upper floor. We're now taking you into the back rooms of the main floor of this building. The whole main floor is 10,000 square feet and this whole area is about 2,000 square foot. Again, notice all the electric available in these rooms. 
could be separated into small offices, hair salon, business center, training center. There's plenty of availability for plumbing. And again, you have a lot of light coming in, a lot of window space. Another separate room here, again with electric and plumbing. Good for storage, or separate offices, and possibly living quarters. As we exit out this door, we come into the main room again. Another separate walled room. This house is all trimmed in white. And as you come in this area, we come to an open staircase that leads us down to the basement of this building. We're now coming downstairs in the lower part of the building, and you have to notice this very cool staircase. We've got an industrial look with the metal and the wood for the steps. It really leads to a very inviting area for, let's say, a brewery or a banquet center. And off to your right here, there are all windows, bringing in lots of light for a lower basement area of a building. You get to see the rural setting outside. This building is very functional, has, has uh, industrial style doors that you can bring in large equipment down here. Plenty of floor space. Off here on the right is a thousand square feet alone of just space. Then we open up into another big area with 3,000 square feet. Plenty of electric on the floors, walls, cable throughout. Could be used for a training center, um, office space. There's many things here that um, the township would love to meet with you about and, and see what you could do with this building. Lots of opportunities. I'm going to take you out into the garage area now. Behind me is the open staircase and we are headed this way to show you a former workshop. So I want to take you back in here. Again, there's plenty of electric in this room, light coming in, two industrial doors to bring in equipment for a workshop, possibly, or again, just storage. It's a very secure building. It has um, secure ADT system currently set up in it. As we come back out in this area, there is another staircase that brings you back up to the main floor. And then out here into the garage. We have four large garage doors with plenty of drainage in the floor for water. We enter off the garage into a bathroom that has a shower in it. This building has a real um, modern or industrial feel to it. There are separate rooms off the garage here that could be used for work rooms. Very clean, freshly painted. We have a heat pump exchange system throughout the whole building in all the walls and floors. We will show you the room that that runs out of shortly. It's just effective. It helps keep the building at an even temperature. Another storage room. And another storage or work room. As we enter into this hallway, it brings us back around to the main room. The building has lots of spots to store things. Um, and again, we're just excited to see what can be done with this uh, amount of space here. You are now entering an area off from the large floor space on the lower level that could be used for possible living quarters. We have three separate rooms connected here that could be served as office or bedroom. We have a bathroom in this room with plenty of storage, a tub unit, and this room's carpeted, new paint, 
Large windows, again, you get a great view of the outside. Plenty of electric in here. And again, we have more storage in this room. We are looking at seven acres of woods that sits in the middle of this 20 acres of property. We are actually on the back side of the building right now, which has a large cement patio. Could be used for tables, picnic area, could still hold uh, meetings out here. It's very secluded, very inviting. Just a real peaceful uh, serenity feeling out here. We are on the east side of the building where the driveway comes around to a large cement area. The retaining wall shows you that it is a walkout style building, has a lower level with all glass that's walkout. Here are four stalls for a garage. And we have a workroom off here, the garage area. And Again, we're going to go over this way and show you the outside patio. We're in the utility room of this large building where the two large hot water heaters are, your heat pump system. It's a clean room, easy to access. You can get in from uh, the main door from the outside. You've got your large electrical boxes and plenty of space.